dear sweet soul. It's time to truly, finally, surrender. To trust fall into the abyss of faith in the unknown. Every moment holds the potential to behold the beauty and the purpose of the path you're on. Even when you feel like shit, allow it. Revel in the permission you just gave yourself to be the beautiful, holy, dark mess that you are. to fall to the depths of the pit in your heart you keep avoiding and judging yourself for. Because only from this place can you assess just how deep it is. What cast off, misunderstood piece of you may be found here. And what you need to do to love it and reclaim it the integral part of who you are that it has always rightfully been. Only from this place can you find closure and comfort as you climb out more whole and fill it back in with the lush dark earth and perhaps a few loving seeds of your choosing that will one day grow and spread hope, health, and wholeness through the grounds of your weird, wonderful soul. Notice when you find yourself avoiding your own pain, your own shame, and take your time, but consciously allow yourself to go there. Make it a habit to pay heed to the parts of you that along the way will inevitably cry out for love and acceptance from the shadowy places in your soul that you hesitate to visit. And when the joy inside your being knocks at the door of your heart, don't you dare ignore it. Give yourself permission to go there fully too. If you're committed to fully experiencing all that your wildly imperfect human life has to offer you, walking through the sadness, confusion, or heaviness will be inevitable. But when you embrace this reality, just as inevitable as the walk through the light, the reconnection, the ecstatic love, the recognition of your own color and brilliance and inner power. The reverence and awe of just how beautiful and blessed life can be. Quit judging yourself for being human. Human is raw. Stop resisting the journey you are meant to take into the embodiment of all of who you are. Trust that the low moments are there to not only teach you, 
but to give you an opportunity to reclaim a part of yourself that can only be found in the place it's been cast off to. The way to honor yourself most is to meet yourself there. Meet yourself in the places you've allowed society or even yourself to deem as wrong or scary or freakish or weird. There is nothing wrong with you. Meet yourself in your discomfort, no matter how extreme it may feel. And trust that there's someone out there who's been there before and loves you precisely for who you are right there in that space. Trust that there is fruit to bear from this experience that will help you live your life more fully, more authentically, more lovingly towards yourself and as a result toward the rest of humanity. Empathize with yourself. Let yourself scream or cry and don't try to fix anything. Just be there. And when you feel lost or confused or hopeless, trust in your own goodness to direct and uplift you to where you need to be. Trust in the forces of benevolence and the powers that be as an extension of your own internal guidance system. Let go and trust in the waters of life to carry you into the flow of your highest awareness. herself to you. Accept her.